Hi guys, it's Karen. Welcome back to my channel. What I'd like to do today is send out a big thank you. I received uh, some happy mail and I wanted to come on and say thank you because there's no note in the packages that were sent. And I wanted to um, just say thank you to the people or person who sent it. It came in two packages. So I don't know if it was one person or two people. So if you want to uh, leave a comment down in the description box below, let me know if you sent them. That would be wonderful. Then I can thank you personally. But uh, right now I'm just kind of giving a blanket thank you. So I got these beautiful Tombow colorless blenders, three of them, which I assume I will have to use <laughs> because I'll probably use them up. I had one that I used uh, on a couple of things with my, dis not my distress ink, but my, um, uh, yeah, Derwent ink tents, and um, it dried up, so um, three is a great idea, <laughs> just, just to let you know. <laughs> so I want to thank you so much. I'm going to test drive these in just a minute, but I also want to thank you so much for the um, beautiful... Uh, pencil case here. This is a, what they call a champagne color in the background and uh, this is the brand here. I can't pronounce that. These are really well made and nicely padded and they have the uh, nice gray on the inside with the pencil loops. This is a 120 um, pencil case so you can put 120 pencils in here and it, it's just gorgeous. I love the ones with the little handles on them because I put them in my bookcase and I need something to pull them out with. And if you don't know by now, I absolutely hate the plastic uh, trays that come in the tins that the pencils come in. So I still have my Albrecht Dürer watercolor pencils in the tin. At least it has the um, elastics so I can pull it up but the plastic trays they just do a number when I touch them like fingernails scratching on chalkboard <laughs> that's what that plastic does to me <laughs> so thank you so much I can put at least one of the three pencils that I have in tins into one of these <laughs> thank you thank you thank you okay we're gonna test drive the um, tombos here so I have a tablet and I have some watercolor pencils and I picked three different colors because why not? Water works different on these three so we're going to see what this little guy does. So take one out. It has some, um, yeah, the brush tip on this end. It's kind of got some push on it but not much. Okay, so it's not a real soft one like a Copic pen or anything like that. And then it's got a bullet tip on this side. So we're going to go with the bullet tip, which you would probably use for um, smaller areas. And that works really well with that. And this paper is um, not the best paper. I mean, it's not watercolor paper or anything. So I got a little pilling there and that's my fault, not the not this guy. It's my fault. <laughs> so then we're going to see how, how that does well. Okay, we'll bring it in here. I would normally wipe off the brush tip on a piece of paper, but that works beautifully. Bring it up so you can see that. They blended it out really nice. Like I said, I got pilling on the other end. That's my fault. This paper is an odd paper. So we'll go into a color book. Let's see, what do I have? Okay, we're gonna try it out in this book. It's um, this one. <laughs> it's got nice thick paper. I've used watercolors in it before. So we're going to just put some purple down here on this butterfly and see how it does. Okay. 
and a little over here. All right, get out the pen. And then start down here where most of that color is. And then bring it up lightly into these areas. Yeah, I think that works out really well. So it gives us a nice, was I off camera when I did that? I hope not. <laughs> a nice little purple variegation there, variation. Um, the paper does peel a little bit with that. I noticed that a little bit, but I mean, you can brush that away. It doesn't take too long to dry either. And then we'll see how, Oh, what color purple did I have? Um, I just grabbed one, so let's read it. Mauve. Yeah. Try to find mauve in this one. Mauve, mauve, mauve. Where are you? Magentas. I wouldn't think it would be on this side. Here it is. Okay. So we're just going to take the pencil and lay it on top of that. over quite nicely. So that's what the two look like together. That'll work really well. So yeah, cool. Awesome. Glad I got three of them. <laughs> I might end up using them all till they dry out. So thank you so much. I really appreciate your thoughtfulness and your support. It just means a lot to me. So thank you for these and also thank you for the pencil case, which is going to come in so handy and save my poor little hands. <sighs> thank you guys for watching and I will see you in another video. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Take care everyone. Bye now.